Hey, what's up? In this video, I'm going to show you guys what four, maybe 4.5 companies that you guys need to start looking at before NVIDIA buys them all up. That's right. The tech giant NVIDIA has been investing inside of many companies and four of them are public, 4.5 of them are public and they're going to acquire these companies. And these are companies that you might want to start looking at before NVIDIA acquire these companies. Because if NVIDIA acquire these companies, that stock price is going to shoot through the roof and that is the banger that we've been looking for for a long time. So we take a good look at these companies, get in early. This could be the play of our lifetime. Now we're gonna drive straight into this video. I'm not gonna waste any of your time. So the links to Moomoo is gonna be down in the description. You signed up, depositing $100, you got to get up to 15 free shares just from depositing $100. That is by far the easiest way to get your account kit started. I'ma also leave a link to Weeble. Deposit up to $500 and you could get 20 free fractional shares. Guys, do not miss out on free money opportunity. But like I said, let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. Now, insider trading is illegal. Do not inside trade. In fact, even if you try to inside trade it'll be very hard to find that kind of information out there to normal investors like me and you but nvidia ain't no dummies right nvidia got a lot of ai companies out there acquiring their chips they're buying their chips um they are customers of nvidia so nvidia is looking at that list right and they're saying hey this company is buying a whole bunch of our chips Company B is buying a whole bunch of our chips. Company C, D, E, F, G, they're all buying a whole bunch of our chips. Let's start taking a look at these companies right now that's spending the most money on us and spending the most money with us and see what they're doing inside of their companies to see if we need to invest inside of them even further. So NVIDIA ain't no dummies. They're looking at the customer list and they're saying this company is buying a lot of our chips. They need our chips in order to run these AI applications, right? So if they're buying this much money, uh, from us, maybe we need to start investing to them. And that's what NVIDIA has been doing for the last couple of years. In fact, they invest over 40 different companies, right? They invest well over 40 different companies, but only four of them are publicly traded. And that's why I'm bringing you in this video. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Now, I know you guys are asking, how do I find this information on how, well, on what companies NVIDIA is investing into? Well, we have to check in with the SEC. So let me show you guys how to find this information. And then we're going to go over each of these stocks, how much they've been investing in the past, if they increased their investments, right? And what companies have they cut out from their investments? So let's go ahead and put that up right now. Okay, here we are on the SEC. All you guys got to do is go to the SEC and then the Agar EDGAR. And then you want to go to this part right here and type in that ticket symbol. I already got it pulled up. And once you pull it up, you want to scroll down to their findings and you want to look for the 13 FHR. You're going to click on that. Once you click on that, it's going to give you everything that you need to see. So let me show you right quick. You're going to hit filings. And then right here where it says um, information table, you're going to hit that. And then it's going to bring up these four companies. So let's go over this list right quick. All right, here we are on the first one, which is ticker symbol AMR Arm Holding. Now, ARM Holdings help make the blue chips in order to create CPUs. CPUs is pretty much the brains of computers, and CPUs is what you need in order to make the, uh, the, the NVIDIA's graphic cards and the AI implications like that. So a ARM Holdings, ticker symbol ARM, has been very huge inside the AR. Um, so, AR, so ARM, so ARM Holdings have been very huge inside of the uh, AI industry boom. In fact, over the last month, they're up 27%. Over the last year to date, they're up 85%. And if we take a look at the one year, they're up 167%. Now here's the kicker. NVIDIA already tried to buy out. They already tried to acquire arms holding for around $40 billion. But the SEC stepped in and said, hey, no, because they would have became a, um, a monopoly, right? So the SEC stepped in and said, hey, no, you can't acquire arms holding. You guys are already a powerhouse. If you buy them, you guys are a monopoly and you would control everything. So they already stepped in and kind of stopped it, right? So they tried to buy them for $40 billion, so they told them no. So what they did instead is they started to invest some of that money inside of arm holdings. Now, the last time I looked at the, um, the filings, they was investing around $147 million inside of arm holdings. But in the most recent filings, as you you guys can see they're investing 245 million dollars so they increased their investments um for from the last time i looked at them to now they increased it by 
almost $100 million, which is completely insane. Now, arms holdings have been exploding over the last year long. Is it too late for us to get in? I don't know, but NVIDIA has been buying them up. They have been buying many more shares of them over the last couple of months. So this is one that we might need to keep an eye on. They already tried to acquire them. They keep they increased their investments by $100 million, which is completely insane, from $147 million to $245 million. Guys, that kind of growth right there is what pushed companies to have 160 seven percent growth in just one year so arms holdings is number one on the list let's look at um the second holdings nano now second one on this list is nano imaging ticker symbol nnox now nano is a mechanical imaging company that helps scans with ct scans and using ai to try to find chronic diseases early right now that is Completely insane that AI and their chips from NVIDIA can help you find chronic diseases early through the use of AI and CT scanning. Now, NVIDIA, the last time I checked, they was investing $380,000 and now they upped it to $582,000. So that is an increase. They're not investing much, but $582,000 is a lot of money. If we take a look over the last three months, they're down in the year to date, they're actually up 24% probably after nvidia started to invest a little bit more money in tuna now finding now using ai in the medical industry takes a little bit more time to um, make your money back to make a profit but once it does guys these companies completely explode and it's at um, seven dollars and 85 cents right now at the time of recording of this video as you guys can see they had their explode up right there and then it's slowly on the decline back down so if it pull back anymore maybe to around the six dollar range this might be a company that i need to add to my portfolio remember we we're just taking a look we we're going to take a deep dive but this is one that i might actually really take a real deep dive in and add to my portfolio because it's a little bit more affordable to me now the number three on our list is going to be tickle symbol rx rx there it goes on recursion pharmaceuticals. Now they are a biotech company that try to help decode biology. They're decoding biology with the use of um, AI. So they've been buying up a lot of NVIDIA chips. Over the last three months, they're down 24%. The last year, they're down 5%. So they are on the decline. But the good thing about this is that NVIDIA is investing $76 million. Now the last time I looked, they invested $76 million. This time, they're still investing $76 million. So they did not increase it anymore. Um, that might be a signal, but if they ever do in the future decide to increase it, then that might be the bump that we're looking for from RxRx. It's at $8.59. It's been on a decline for a while. In fact, if we look at the last five years, once they went public, they're on sale. They went public at around $33. So if it could go from $8 to $33, this is the home run we're looking for, especially if NVIDIA possibly acquired them in the future. But over the last couple months, they haven't invested any more money into them. So they're stuck at $76 million, which is still a lot of money. But but this is one that if you believe in the technology, if you believe in the future that you might want to add to your portfolio. The last one on this list that's on the holding, that's on the um, filings with the SEC is S-O-U-N, which is SoundHound AI. Now this, this is with the AI assistance with speech, right? Um, over the last three months, as you guys can see, that's the spike right there when NVIDIA started to buy them. You know, it always goes up and then it starts to have the pullback. So we're waiting for a little bit more of a pullback. In fact, over the last year, they're still up 77%. Now, the last time I checked, they, they was investing $3.7 million. And now with the most uh, growth, they're now investing $10 million. So they went from $3.7 to $10 million. They really believe in the future um, with AI, with assistance um, to uh, text-to-speech, no, not text-to-speech, with assistant AI speech. So NVIDIA is going to continue to invest in them, I believe, in the future. Right now, they're $4.68, which is uh, right around the price point that I could get in on. As you guys can see the pattern after the boom, there's always a pullback, except for with ARM Holdings. ARM Holdings is probably going to continue to shoot to the roof. That, that might actually be the next NVIDIA, especially with them making uh, CPU chips. It's the blueprint for CPU chips. So that is the, so the first one is ARM Holdings. The second one is Nano Imaging. The third one is Recursion Pharmaceuticals. And the fourth one is SoundHound AI. Now the fifth one on my list is gonna be TS PH, they was investing into them, but I think they pulled out in the United States and you can't buy them on Robinhood, so you gotta come over to the great um, brokerage account that I showed you guys at the beginning of this video, Moomoo, which allows you to buy shares outside of the country. You could come over to uh, Weeble and type in TSPH. Um, NVIDIA is investing around, they was investing around $3 million into them. They 
um, specialized in autonomous driving for trucking that was inside the United States, but I believe they pulled outside of the United States and went back to China, but NVIDIA was still investing into them. The last time I checked, I got to do a little bit more research on them on TSPH, but um, autonomous driving and trucking in the future could be very huge. So this is one that is a penny stock that I've never really fooled with penny stocks. That's why I call it a 4.5 and not really a five um, for this list, but this is one that they was investing into. So that is the fifth 4.5. Um, one that I'm gonna bring you guys. And that's it, Dreamers. Let me know which one you like down in the comment section. Did you like all of them? Did you only like ARMS? Did you only like RXRX? Did you only like the imaging company? Um, the biology company? Let me know which one you like down in the comment section that we could discuss about in the future. If you guys know about any other company that the video might have their eyes on before they go, uh, <laughs> before they go just eight wire and buy them all up and then acquire that company, let me know about that down in the comment section as well. But yeah, guys, don't forget to pick up your free stocks. That link is going to be down in the description to Moomoo. Sign up with them, deposit $100, get up to 15 free shares. The big seven, the major companies, the Microsoft, the Googles, please don't miss out on that opportunity. That link is gonna be pinned in the comment section. That link is gonna be down in the description. And while you're down there, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. I think hitting that notification bell helps more than you can possibly even imagine. And it's also free to subscribe and hit that notification bell. But other than that, guys, make sure that you uh, come back in the future so that we can see how these stocks perform. But other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show. And I'm out. Peace.